We'll have the ushers come forward as we continue worship in a time of giving. I hope that all of us during this Lenten season also have our vision expanded as we think about our world services that uh, we will be participating in and contributing to in a very short time. And many of you do it on a weekly basis and we appreciate that. For many in this broken world, opportunity is an elusive commodity. Poverty, oppression, illiteracy, discrimination, and neglect deny individuals and families opportunity to improve their lives and create a better future for themselves. But thanks, thanks to God, in part, our gifts to the world services of the Salvation Army is providing opportunity that changes the world. This year, over half a million students, ages three through 18, will receive the opportunity of a Christian education from kindergarten through primary, junior, and secondary levels at over 2,700 schools operated by the Salvation Army. I didn't realize that myself. That's amazing. Countless others will receive opportunity to become self-sufficient by acquiring business skills, vocational training, literacy education, even microfinancing loans, and other income generating tools through a variety of Salvation Army programs. This week, consider how our Lenten gifts to world services empowers people, transforms lives, and impacts communities for good and for God. Consider how the gift of opportunity helps to change the world, shall we pray. Dear Lord, enlarge our vision to be nearer to your vision for a lost world. We pray, Lord, that as we think about giving, both for our own community, our own core, our own church, but also as we think of our giving for a world that is so desperately need you, help us to be generous just as you were generous to us. And we pray that you will bless our giving in Jesus' name. Amen.